All right, so we're about to make our meal plan for this week, this Sunday through Friday, um, Saturday the 9th. And we're gonna put down everything that we wanna have for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then we're going to make a grocery list based on that. Why are you messing with your dad? Don't do that again. And then we're gonna make our grocery list. So I can go and get all our groceries based on our menu. We're also gonna be doing some meal prep where we cook a couple things pre-made, like our breakfast sandwiches and stuff for the week. We're gonna meal prep them. Meal prep them. So, okay, but what do you guys want for like type of, so I gotta put snacks for nighttime snacks. So I'm changing the way that we do things, guys. Instead of having dinner at night, we're gonna, I'm gonna have dinner ready as soon as you guys get home. All right, so here's our list for Sunday through Saturday. I'll be going shopping again next Saturday. And this is our grocery list for the week. I broke it down by store. We're gonna basically be going to one, two, three, four different stores. But I only gotta get one thing from here, so I'll probably do pickup. And then the rest of the stores I have to stop at today. So I'm gonna go grab this list really quick. And then I'm gonna be doing some meal prepping too, which I'll do another video for, showing you guys how I'm gonna meal prep all of this. I'll be pre-making the breakfast sandwiches, pre-making some muffins for the week, homemade muffins, blueberry, and chocolate chip. Which is, did I put the frozen blueberries? Yep, frozen blueberries and chocolate chips on here. And then we're also gonna be doing some pre-made snacks for the week like some granola on um, bars that I'm gonna make homemade and I'll show you guys how I do all of that and how I prep it and then how I store it for the week so it can be ready when we need it so let's go shopping so we're going to Sam's Club first and I'm gonna get everything on the list and then I'm gonna get the rest of the stuff and then I'll also show you guys how I meal prep and meal plan to make things a little bit easier Actually, and I'm only getting what's on the list. Nothing more. Nothing less. Actually, I'm lying. Because the only thing I didn't add to the list, but I knew I had to get, was water. And I'm so annoyed because I don't have the app on my phone. And I can't download apps right now because my phone is like being weird. And it's like full and everything. So, I didn't want to have to stop over here to get a, like a printout of my... Um, membership because I don't know how else I can go about you know scanning in to cash out my stuff so that's what I'm going to be in the first so I'm I gotta do this mm -hmm. only because I didn't bring my other phone all right so I got my little printout ID and we're gonna start our shopping oh no you can press this though you can push it I'm just getting my little clipper <laughs> Right so this cart is being weird so we're gonna get the waters first to put some weight up there because the wheels is not really turning the way they're supposed to so we're gonna get some waters first because they're not on the list and i don't want to forget those okay we're gonna get like six of them You get what 40 bottles for 648. I feel like you can't beat that anywhere else. So chocolate chips is right here, which is good. Ew. Excuse me. So these are 1398. Let me grab one of these. So I'm gonna cross those off. Anything else over here? Yes, the Velveeta cheese shells is over here. All right, so the Velveeta right here. Oh, and it's on sale for twelve dollars. It's just like fourteen. So that's good. I should probably get two. But I think one would be enough, right? Probably not. At least. It'll probably be enough for like two weeks. I won't have to come back for like two weeks. I won't have to probably come back on my next shopping trip and get any more. 
Maybe the one after them. The Nutella is right here. So I'm gonna get that. I wonder if the real oats are down here too. You know what? I did forget to put this on my list. I put pancakes on my list for breakfast, but I forgot to put the syrup, so I'm gonna have to grab one of these. I know I have like a sugar-free one, but I don't have any regular syrup. So, I'm gonna get that with the Nutella, and I'm gonna add it to the list. And then we're gonna check one book off. What else did I already get? The Velveeta. I'll go ahead and check that out. Alright, so I'm getting the old fashioned oats because I'm making some granola bars. And this is what I need. Oh. Well, I'll be back. I need both hands. Alright, so I got the old fashioned oats. Some grilled oats, whatever. Okay, now we need some dinner rolls, which is over here. Come on. I'll let them come out first. All right, so they have the rolls right here that I wanted for six sixty-eight. And then I grab one of these. I'm gonna be making a kids like you know how schools have like the chicken nuggets with some like string beans or something then I have like dinner rolls on the side that's what I got those for I think they're like perfect like the school ones I said they got these real slider buns I'm gonna definitely think of something next week to make that I can use these for maybe like like no maybe like some mini cheeseburgers or something I'm gonna add to the menu for next week and I'm gonna specifically get these for it because they look so good I gotta get the steak from here. What is this? Oh, you know what? Is those is those Brussels sprouts? Mm -hmm. I wanted to try those. I've never had a Brussels sprout before, so I'm like, great. Let me try these. You ever had Brussels sprouts? Yeah. Huh? You don't like them? I never had Brussels sprouts. So, I'm over here to grab the steak, which is probably on the other side. I was gonna grab the sample while I'm right here and try these. Oh, thank you. All right, so. I got these Brussels sprouts that I'm about to try. I never had them before. My daughter said she had them before, she didn't like them. This is my first time ever having Brussels sprouts. I'm doing all these first on camera. Okay. It was a little off at first, like the texture, but it's like a green, like a collard green almost texture around it. That's actually good. Hmm. All right, so. I'm trying to show y'all and just dropped it. And I'm mad, these are good. I'm really upset I dropped it. Like, but it's really good. I wouldn't got too far. Yeah, these are good. I didn't realize Brussels sprouts and stuff. Tastes like greens almost, but like, I don't know. I like them a lot. And if they low in calories and carbs, I would definitely like start making these at home. I'm gonna get some of these to make at home. We're gonna check out the other ones over there too. Right, so let me see what their steaks are looking like. These are the ones I usually get. So I never get them when they're this high. It gotta be like 30 something for me to get them. These real are like really, really 
pricey. Mm. I don't buy them if they're like over 35, so. I'm gonna have to go somewhere else to get the steaks. I'm gonna have to add them to like another list, maybe for tops. So I'm going there to get ground beef, so. I'm gonna have to go there for the steaks too. Yeah, they don't have no, unless I trade out steaks this week for like a stew meat. These are priced really good actually. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna trade out steaks and do like a stew meat. Cause these I feel like I can like almost fry on the outside, make like a, a steak tip or something. And I can get two of these what I usually pay for one of the steaks. So we're gonna change our menu a little bit. And these are both 20, so I'll grab these two. All right, so what I'm gonna do is these are priced really good. So I'm gonna get these instead. And instead of having steak on that day where I'm gonna have steak and shrimp, I'll just like sear those and then bake them on like a garlic butter sauce and then put those over some potatoes. Or yellow rice though, that'll still be good. Um, yeah. So let's cross this out and do a beef stew meat. There we go. And that's the plan. Let's keep going. They got hickory smoked turkey. I don't want to try no smoked turkey. Rotisserie chicken over there. I think he's going up though. He's putting his stuff up. And this is like a raspberry chipotle dip with a French baguette. So, you doing that? This? Okay. Can we try this? You can try it. This is raspberry chicken. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. What did you call it? Um, this is raspberry chicken. Okay. It's like a, a spicy sweet. It's sweet, like for the raspberries, but it's also spicy. It's actually good. I can snack on this. Mm -hmm. Take some tea and put on a baby or something. That's really good. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It's weird. It's like spicy, but it's sweet from the raspberry, but it's, it's so good together. I think that would actually be really good for our bagel board that we're doing. To add a little difference, you know. He's the right here. Oh, oh no, I was about to say 16. Oh no, child. It's six. <laughs> okay. Woo. We're gonna get one of these. <laughs> Let me add that to the list. Because it wasn't on here. Raspberry Chipotle did. Where, what are you, you've been doing, crying? Like, I can't keep up. As soon as I see the ad type, you're gone again. This is gonna go fire big on it. And I think those it's gonna make a, a really good twist to it. So Yeah. The graham crackers are with the snacks. What do we do? We close it down and then bring it up. This is a cheesy broccoli bake. I can't even eat no more though. I'm so full. You wanna try that? Is a cheesy broccoli bake? No? I was about to say I'm so full from tasting stuff. All right, so I'm just grabbing some bacon, $11.97. That is actually a good price this week for the member's mark. So I'm gonna grab one of these. Oops, excuse oh, me. Oh, for you. Okay. Hello, ready? Okay. Shrimp and butter, corn and cob. They're on the same area, so let's go. And I put half and half. Yep, half and half on here too. Let me grab that because it's right here. I'm gonna 
got four of them, 252. I'll be back with I need both hands. All right, so I got the half and half. The butter is right there. And I'm gonna do one salted and one unsalted like I did last time. Cause it ended up working out good for the different things I was baking. Alright, so we got the butter. Alright. Well, I think it's back that way. You can. Alright. So I'm grabbing the shrimp and gonna pour it in the cup. I want jumbo. Okay, right here. Yep. For 13. Hopefully they even have corn in the cup last time. I mean this time because the last few times I came, they didn't have it. So it doesn't look like I have any luck today either. So no corn in the cup. Nope. I don't have any corn in the cup, but they have the blueberries, so I'm gonna grab those. The blueberries for eight forty-eight. All right, so I got the blue. Oh. What am I doing? I got the blueberries and I got the shrimp. They don't have corn a cob, so I'm gonna have to put that on the price right. and grand crackers and nuts which is all this way all right so the nuts are right here but i want to do almonds because amora is like allergic to peanut butter so i'm assuming she's also allergic to the peanuts that make the peanut butter so i'm just gonna grab some almonds but they don't have them here so i'm gonna put those on the list for price right i don't think they have all right they have some right here okay because I'd rather get them like this because they like eleven dollars. That price right for a small bag, but this is for twelve. Is a way better price. Alrighty. So I'm looking for the chicken nuggets. Please don't tell me they're all out. They got one bag of chicken nuggets left. Guess I'm just getting that one bag. Grab that one bag. <laughs> oh, grab them both. There's two down there. All right. All right, and then the steaks that we need is right here for 14. I'm gonna grab maybe three. Oh, yeah. so we got both the nuggets, the steaks, and now we just need the graham crackers, and now we're ready to go. And that would be everything, right? Nuts, the granola. No, we gotta get those still. Nuggets and steaks for steaks. So we grab the graham crackers that we can go. Mm -hmm. You can actually start towards the front and I'll grab the graham crackers and meet you up there. Mm -hmm. Just go to whatever line is shorter. Honestly, I put that we're gonna be having crackers a lot for our little cheese boards. So I didn't have Ritz on here, but I'm gonna add those and grab these with the graham crackers. All right, so I found them right here, $6.98. I heard go to the front, so I'm gonna need both hands. I'll see you guys at the register. Mm -hmm. And that's it, that's everything on the list. Mm -hmm. see how much it come up to. Hopefully not more than like 250, but we'll see. I am so proud of myself forgetting what was on the list and only what was on the list well no let me not say that because i added like one two two things but that's okay because they didn't have one thing that i needed which was the corner cob so that's okay but that was really good so now it's off to the next door which is going to be which one probably audi's first because they close a little bit earlier than price right all right and that's it for this trip